Hi everyone, in this video we are going to see about Nifty breakout levels. By watching this video you can gain some knowledge about market and how to trade on your own through Nifty also. Those who are new to channel kindly subscribe the channel and select the ring bell. If you feel like the video kindly select the like button and share it. By selecting the name of this channel NSC Commodity Trader you will go to the home page. In home page you can see more videos like strategy videos, indicator videos in playlist in both Tamil and English languages. By watching these videos you can gain more knowledge about market also. We are also taking more advanced trading strategy and we are also providing levels for commodity also. If you want to know about these details means you can WhatsApp or contact the number in below video. Nifty on Friday, Nifty formed a bearish candle and it's a big one during the last few trades. It's a big bearish candle it formed and uh, market opened above 12,050 range. It opened near 12,050 range. After it opened near 12,050, it crossed 10 points. But again, market started to fall down. Uh, it's a huge fall majorly caused by the uh, PSU banks. The main reason the bank started to fall is the day before RBI policy has been uh, announced like unchanged. After that announcement from the day itself onwards, uh, like a Thursday onwards, the market started to fall from 12,000 range and uh, even market cracked 12,000 during Thursday. But again Friday it started to came back but still there are negative news so the bank setups are started to fall once the market got opened like the major one that got fall is S bank, SBI bank, HDFC in non-finance banking service so these are all the major fall S bank cracked 10% uh, SBI more than 5% HDFC more than 3% like this the major set or major uh, major banking major thing major finance thing got fallen Due to that the market started to fall hugely and it even cracked 11,900. It even went below 11,900 but still a major support has been seen at 11,880 range. Due to that 11,880 support range market got recovered in last minute last trade last few hours last half an hour like that. So after that recovered market can uh, uh, lately closed above 11,921 range. So market is currently uh, went down uh, due to the reason of PSU banks. So that is the major reason. And then the, there are uh, oil opening the time only. There some positive news has been seen in Reliance like that uh, the gap up has been seen. And then the positively finished stock is uh, Infratel. So these things only has been uh, positiveness in the market. But uh, market came below 11,950. It's indicating a little bit negativeness in the market. Uh, let's take a look at the weekly candle also. Last, what happened in the last week like that. Uh, the last week a big bearish candle has been formed. And then the candle starts from uh, 12,137. It's uh, almost open high same for that uh, previous week. And then the, from that point onwards, the market has been fallen up to 11,888. This is the low for the past week. So it's indicating a big bearish candle, but still it is in supportive ranges only. So market if it hold above 11,800. So 11,800 is the major support for the past month. So we are expecting this December if market has been able to hold this 11,800 means in the coming weeks in this December month, the market can go well in the near future also and the next year also. But if this range 11,800 got breakout in the coming weeks means you can expect some uh, short term negative trend in the market. Up to new year you can expect some negative trend if it if it didn't able to hold 11,800 because 11,800 is in major support. Okay, let's go for intraday so that you can have what to do on Monday like that. <coughs> on Monday as you can see market is uh, if market opened above 11,900 means you can take supportive ranges 11,900, 880 range as a supportive level. If 900 range got breakout means you can go for selling and expect some uh, 40 points in the downside. 
and market cracked 850 means another 40 points we can expect up to 11,800 range 11,800 range is the huge support so the first level support is going to be 11,900 if market opened below 11,900 means then 11,900 itself will form a huge resistance for the market need to cross over okay and then the next crossover next resistance has been seen at 11,950 so 11,950 is the next level resistance if market uh, crossed 11,950 means you can expect market up to 12,000 the major support has been in the 12,000 for the past two weeks that has been broken out so it's still a negativeness in the market only so whenever market started to fall you can expect some huge fall in the market due to RBA rate cut policy uh, that uh, unchanged has been uh, not very well ended up for share market okay we are also taking more advanced trading strategy class and we are also providing levels for commodity also if you want to know about these details means you can whatsapp or contact the number in future if you want to see more videos like this means kindly subscribe my channel and select the ring bell thank you